<laughs> Alrighty, so... I am going to make this tutorial for a friend of mine because he doesn't know and how to get Miku Miku dance. So, here's the thing. Open up the internet, as you can clearly see. Yeah, I'm on MSN. So you go onto Google. As you can clearly see, Google is right there. See? Google. And then all you have to do is just go onto VP, VP. You should be able to go onto the first one where it says it right there. There is the Japanese page, but it can be translated in English. So, what you have to do is basically go on to where it says Miku Miku Dance. There is the 5.24 version, and then there is the 7.30 version. I honestly prefer to use this one because, from what I heard, they say this version is a lot better because it adds more color to it. Don't get me wrong, 5.24 helps too, but I disbelieve 7.30 has more softer color. And if you probably still are more interested, there are these videos in the bottoms on how it tells you on what you have to do. Anyway, moving on. Suppose I'm going to download 5.24. Now, unless you have WinRAR, it should be able to open this up, where it says Miku Miku Dance. You go on to open, and it's downloading. So wait for it to be 100% sure, so you can download that file. And as soon as that happens, then it should be able to open up something else for you. Now, if interested, I'm going to show on how to get WinRAR. So you go into the search bar, type in WinRAR. You should be able to go into this place called the RAR Lab, the site. It should look something like this. That's how you get WinRAR. Well, the RAR Lab actually. So in order to get it, you can go to WinRAR times 64. It has it in different languages, but I chose English. It, ha it gives you an evaluation version, so it's free. You don't have to pay. So, okay. As you can see how this is opened up, that's for the Miku Miku dance, and it's saved onto WinRAR. And you go on to say MMD, you open that up and you open to here. You should get something like this. So, to get the model, just go on to the red box where it says model manipulation. Everything here is on the documents. So suppose I can choose any random character I can. So let's say I wanted to use Naru. Where it says model information, go to OK, and she appears. Voila. So, if you're curious, there, there's a blue box where it says bone manipulation. So, let's say I wanted to make her wave. Or say hi. Okay, you see what I did here? Now, when you go onto the blue box, go to box select, and you just keep it at that, and go to register. Now, if you want everything else to be saved, just in case, you go on to select all, and go to register. And where it says frame manipulation, you just go on to the next slide and look, she stays the same. She doesn't move, go back into where her arms were. 
standing out. So, anyway, on the top, where it says physical operation, you can put on to any time. You can clearly see her hair is flowing. So we don't have to move around. And for her, she has many facial expressions. It's in the green box. There's the blink, where it says mouse. That's her mouth. See the big A? Sometimes characters have other things, and where it says other, she doesn't have one it's because it's a blank. And she has one for brows, you know, to make her serious or not. So that's good. And there is another thing, another blue box, I mean, that says view. There's for front, if you can see it. And there is back. There is top, there is right, and left. Camera and front are almost the same thing, so use it wisely. And as you can clearly see that there is the coordinate axis. Now if you want to get rid of that, go into the top, go to view, and go where it says display coordinate axis. Look, poof, like magic. The lines are gone. Now, you know how the screen gets, how it's so short? If you want to make it bigger, go on to s view again and go to screen size. You can put any width and height of choice, but I, I honestly choose 1280 for width and the height 700. And voila, the screen's bigger. Big difference, right? So, if there are any questions of the sort, just feel free. And I hope this tutorial helps so much. And that is all that I have for today. And I am Curly Fries 22 on my YouTube page. You can look for me if you can, or subscribe me. Doesn't matter. So that will be all for today. Hope it helps.